I am now joined by the Assam Education Minister, Dr. Ranus Pegu. Uh, Dr. Ranus Pegu, your first comments on the extremely shocking incident from Dibugar University where this young student was subjected to ragging that uh, he is battling for his life in hospital. Uh, this is very unfortunate and this is a crime against uh, humanity. I, last night I came to know and I talked to the police and also the university authority. I am asking the police and as well as the university authority to take the strongest action possible against these uh, culprits. And this should disappear. This is an old culture. This shouldn't be reported so frequently in the state of Assam. And we are going to take a strong action. I have talked to the uh, Vice Chancellor of Dibugar University and also Guwahati University and asking them to take strong action. Police is doing their duty. Uh, meanwhile, we will be coming out with a certain scheme like all the students staying in host uh, university campuses shall have to take a plea uh, against ragging. And if anything reported against them, them, they will have to leave the hostel or the university campus. We cannot allow this kind of criminal activities to happen in our universities. Absolutely. Uh, now, now that means you said that you will come up with some SOP uh, yes. where all the students living in the hostels or the campus will have to take a pledge. Uh, yes. That means that Assam government is taking the issue very seriously, isn't very it? Very seriously, right. Uh, now, now, finally, uh, you know, what does this reflect? Why do students, instead of, a, in, instead of encouraging a competitive atmosphere in university, you are going to these outdated methodologies of, uh, you know, ragging a youngster? Uh, I have been told that not, there were some unauthorized persons staying in the hostel. Uh, particularly they are ex-students or non-students and I have asked the university authorities that no unauthorized person, ex-student or whatever they may be, they cannot be allowed to stay in the hostel once their course is over. They should be, and if necessary, police is to be reported and FIR is to be lost against such unauthorized persons staying in the university hostels. Finally, are you planning uh, or are you likely to pay a visit to the Debrugger University? Uh, very soon. Right. Dr. Ranus Pegu, thank you very much indeed for speaking to Northeast Live.